Preparing children for a spiritual life in Christ and eternity is an important endeavor to raising a people who know and share in the nature and inheritance of the one true God who was and is and is to come. Introducing a new addition to the children's ministry of the Church of Pentecost. Jethro Initiative, under the leadership of Pastor Professor Otu Ellis, the project under the auspices of the Church of Pentecost seeks to engage children even more in the things of God. Besides strengthening activities of the children's ministry, the initiative will promote teamwork and unity, create an opportunity for effective evangelism among the children in their community, encourage children to learn social skills, resilience, as well as teach them to love church attendance and participation. The Jetro Initiative is a new program of the children's ministry. Uh, this program has become important because, as most of us know, the membership of the children's ministry today is more than a million. And when you look at the way our programs are structured, our engagement with our children as children's workers is mostly on Sundays, meaning that we meet once every week on Sundays and when you consider the current dispensation that we have which is the COVID period and where services are being held two hours what also comes up is that it means we have less time in terms of engagement so looking at all these things then as we put together a new vision it was important to find other alternative ways to engage our children, what the Jetro Initiative seeks to do is to break our children into smaller groups and then have leadership for these smaller groups. And then there are activities which these groups would be involved in. Now, this is based on the principle of the encounter between Jethro and then Moses. For us, the groups are named based on the fruit of the Spirit in Galatians. Jethro Initiative, as an extracurriculum, has the ability to set the stage for better understanding and a comprehensive way of learning. Activities such as character studies in the Bible, civic education programs, music and drama, community project, and many others have been designed to meet the transformational needs of age groups 7 to 12. 7 to 12 years, they are fairly independent and because J.I. meetings is preferred on Sunday afternoons, they can come to the church premises on their own. That's notwithstanding, some parents still bring their children for J.I. meetings. So with that age category, they are fairly independent so that those who are up to six will always yearn to attend J.I. meeting. Yeah. We seek to promote teamwork and unity amongst the children. We also want to raise godly, transformational future leaders. We also want to make the studying of the Word of God fun and very, very innovative. And we also want to inculcate in the children the high civic responsibility and patriotism. Also, we want to promote holistic development and growth in every child. Also, we want to introduce role models, coach for every child to have a role model, a mentor that the child can learn from. We also want to create the opportunity for every child to have the feel of evangelism, so that the passion and the drive to evangelize becomes part and parcel of every child. We also want to encourage the children to be able to be resilient, 
they should be able to have life skills and practical ministry. And last but not the least, we want to also nurture the children by raising them up in the fear of the Lord and also to ensure that coming to church becomes exciting to them amongst many. The meeting days, we prefer Sunday afternoon between the hours of 2 to 5, but the duration for JI activity is 1 hour 30 minutes. But what we want to ensure is that latest by 5 o'clock, every JI meeting should come to a close so that the children can go home safely. And we're also looking at um, Saturday afternoons could also be preferred depending on the geographical locations. JI is not replacing our normal Sunday service. JI is an extracurricular activity that comes to complement our normal Sunday service to make our services active, very participatory and very attractive. As part of the process to initiate this project, here is a pilot study conducted in Wale Wale. La. We are going to do what? Our fruits. Because God said we should do what? We have to love. We have to love our neighbors. We have to love our sisters. We have to love our friends. We are pasting love in our fruits. Love. So turn it and paste it nicely in your fruits. Asqua PIWC, Padaso. Tishinungwa and Sunyai PIWC. Mo echa ya eche mu, efa Lazarus ni sikeni. Mo baby a Lazarus kwada na mo baby a sikeni su kwada ya. So ya Christo ni mapa. And I said, Sunday school, ni mapa. Oh, oh, we are here. Mama will say, I am yet. It's lateness to Sunday school. Who is to be blamed? The child or the parent? Is church service a form of covenant or appointment with God? If yes is your answer, then it goes to say that lateness is a break of covenant relationship with the covenant keeping God. If he knows that you go out and go and play and be late for church, why will he go? All done very, very well. And I want to give you much applause. God bless you. A long time ago, I, I had some fears, and I was also so shy. But because of the Jetro Initiative, now I've been able to overcome all the shyness that are in me. Because of that, now I can teach in public. I know how to teach with children for them to understand it clearly. I, for instance, I was a shy type and how to express myself is a big problem for me, but Jetro Initiative has helped me a lot. I'm going to identify my talents here. Wow. I'm going to build my confidence level. I'm going to build my So far it's been good, it's been best and then it's been helpful. More than the number of groups that we, were, we wanted to get. So it's very exciting and I'm very happy. They come on time as well. Before we started, we were curious about how we were going to start the whole thing. But uh, surprisingly, our first JI was very exciting and wonderful. The participation and the children too, before the JIs were announcing and then telling them about JI, they didn't know what to expect. But when they came, they were very excited. And myself, I really enjoy JI. Initiative in the Mofrani, the energy strong could be an assum. I'm the one who is an assum. In the Ama Jumedi, no, a cobble call. And you're being a born JI and Bianne. A Cassini BP. Negash a time pony, Cassini Nation, be make a barber so much. And if for fair, no, you are your neighbor. A mu chair for more, she had been a mu for a fair in Bashi. 
na chọ gbe ke bi e hu mi bi be bi e bu ame na wo fe so mo e wo fe mi na ke cha ke mo ba gbe ke bi a se le mi na va na na pon so so ma lo na mi va church na mi pa ma lo ya ko mo e chi na ni wa usro na 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 pon so so mo fi o a tu wa va ko mo na va mo po na totro ye ye ala de bi am be totro ro le a de bi ro le i pe nu wo wa e na po ga be o ye bi e yi le mo ara ma totro de ya do va ma nya to pe ma upo nko mo na ga le ma upo ko bi o de ma upo mo ma totro ye ya ara va na de bi o be ma e yenzu tunde ya ro na ya fara zuwa je ai na yenzu de ka gan ka ma do ka chin na she da ai na suru ka ma e je abenga ya sure shiga wuru mutane ama yanzu da ya shiga muta wuru mutane she yi komi duka she don kon shi yaye yi waka yaye yi komi duka yanzu de na gode ma Allah kama yaro na ya fara zuwa je ai yesi a the fruit of the spirit example ni be a faithfulness kindness goodness it's not self control hey wow so actually you have to be what faithful okay By now, it is Asia cartoons. Mommy, so from nowadays, whatever you ask me to do, or I should help you, I'll do it for you. The AI has changed you. Yes, I hope it will last for long. I thought when they go, they will play. So at first, I was wondering. They will waste their time. Eh eh. It's in a. My confused because because now I'm petting my banana walker. Because if I looked at the time, instead of him to learn, so quite that's one and a half hour. And it is going to be wasted. First, second meeting. Next, also some margin. Because all the thing. Nah. May first and some may I there over share cartoons. But later on, I'll be feeling me and us, mommy. Let me help you because we have to do teamwork. I have three children in the Sunday school. The first one is twelve. The second, second one ten, and the last one seven. And with confidence level, with the second one, it was very low. Uh huh. But frankly, almost started this program, no. I don't know. There when you have some confidence, be, eh? Uh -huh. So I believe, sir, near children's ministry, near here in Abuano, I will recommend every parent, especially, sir. Oh yeah, Pentecost, Ninkwande. I don't think, sir. I I don't see the need, sir. Obema Obat nephew. I recommend it to parents because if you allow the children to go. It will help them, and you, as a parent, it is also going to help you, because when they go, they learn a lot, and what they learn, even though they are children, you will see that it has gotten impact in their lives. Seeing the Jethro Initiative is here to stay. There is a need to assess the performance of the initiative to ensure its growth. The leadership of the Church of Pentecost is calling on all parents and guardians to ensure their children participate in Jethro initiative meetings. For all your children shall be taught by the Lord, and great shall be the peace of your children. Isaiah 54:13. The Jethro initiative for the children's ministry is very strategic and very important. And we believe that it will bring a major transformation in the way our children's ministry is run. We are trusting that, by the grace of God, this will be able to move the ministry forward. We are also hoping that, as we use these groupings, we would also be able to touch other children within our communities. And be able to bring them on board to Christ. If we have to be successful, which we believe we already are successful, we need everyone to join with us so that we can work together to glorify God. So we need our parents. 
because the children's ministry complements what happens within our homes. We also need other stakeholders in the church, the women's ministry, the men's ministry, the youth, to all come on board and help support in this new program. We also are appealing to the leadership of the church to take this Jetro program serious within our areas, within our districts, and within our locals. And as we work together, we believe that the objective that is set with this Jetro initiative would be achieved. <laughs>